Hey guys, Kraken here, and I'm pretty much about to show you a new app called Gorillas. Now, if you do not know who the Gorillas are, or what they are, it is a band, but the the actual, actual real band is just, um, oh, I can't remember his name. Oh, darn, I should have looked it up, but that's okay, though. The real creator of the band actually created a somewhat fake band of four characters. But, let me see if I can at least... Well, there's one of them that's Noodle right there. There's four four members in the band, and there's, uh... If I can remember, Noodle, Russell, Murdoch, and Tootie. Let's see, yes, I accept. Obviously, I'm not gonna read through it. Allow, allow. Okay, there we go. I had to allow a couple things. Now, obviously, this app, right off the bat, is just... I don't know, hopefully it is recording this app. But right now, all you can see is, is that, uh... Yeah, there's that floating thing. That's Murdoch's, uh, that's Murdoch's ski mask. That will lead to his room if you ever tap it. You could always put it, hold up, give it a couple of seconds. Uh, oops, I almost forgot. Um, yeah, the, uh, hold up. Yeah, I guess the camera isn't working for my face anymore. That's okay. It's probably because of the app. But, um, you can look around, although you can just simply turn the camera left and right in order to look at whatever you're looking at right now. But, um, this is his room. He has supposedly a best friend possessing him from who had died. And he's a pretty good rapper and everything. But this app, if for those who do know... About the game, oh, about the game, about the, about the, uh, what's it called, the Gorillas Band, which obviously consists, consists of four members, all four are fake, except for the guy who created the actual band. Um, unfortunately, if I go to tap on specific things, uh, your interactivist with Russell, tell me more. It just pretty much brings you to their rooms, but doesn't allow you to see the actual people. I mean, there's his, there's, a. Uh, Oh man, I keep mixing up their names. Yeah, that Russell's mask, or ski mask, his entire room. But whenever you go to tap on stuff, it just brings you to, well, just other places that you really weren't expecting to go to. I mean, you thought that you it would probably be a game. I mean, this is somewhat of like a VR. You can go to VR if you wanted to, but unfortunately you can't. Okay, well, there's, oh, there's Noodle's room. Which, I just noticed now, I don't know if there's any sound. Oh yes, there is. Okay, there is sound. I'm trying to, like, avoid the rooms that actually do have music playing in the background, because, uh... I don't know what that was. Okay, there's, there's some sounds in here, but all the items that you press on... Oh, look, there's, uh, good old Noodle's little helmet from when she was, uh, in a racing video one time. It was a promotional video for a vehicle called Jaguar, I believe. But all these items and stuff that are around just bring you to places or music, which is not what I expected from this app. It's not that bad, but it it lacks in so much potential. I mean, like, for example, Noodle's, uh... Oh, what's it called? Noodle's little punching bag here. If I go to tap on that and expecting to actually hit it, I can't. It just simply swings back and forth. I mean, it's nice to see that, uh, Noodle's little, uh, I don't know what she is. Is she Chinese? Korean? I really don't know. I haven't really looked into her specific background yet. But either way, this is all her stuff, but like I said, you go on to, like, uh, right here. This is the store. But I don't want to go into the store. Why would I? I don't have anything to shop for. I mean, if I really wanted to, I could probably just go to the actual main website and do that. A lot of this stuff is just silly and not really, uh, what you'd expect. Right? Oh, well, that, if you tap some things, they'll make noises. But if you try to go into other rooms, like right here, which you may not be able to see me doing it, but I'm tapping the screen to actually go forward, but it won't let me. Which kind of sucks, because I want to explore a little bit more of the place. Oh, kitty. Yeah, you tap him once and he meows. That's about it, really. It's not much to this app, really. It, it it lacks in so much. Let's see if I can go to, uh... 
Murdoch's room. Uh, Murdoch, maybe not Murdoch. No, not that one. That one's kind of creepy. Yeah, you do have to look around your room, so you'll end up. Oh, here, here's his room. I'll only go into his room, and that's it, because there's a lot of other rooms you can go into, but they're all basically the same. It's pretty much like a, uh, a touchable poster. Huh. Weird. Very, very weird. This is his room, but he's not here this time. I was here with him the last time and he was like literally um oh what was he doing the last time he i believe he had the eight ball in his hand the magical eight ball and he was just simply juggling it with one hand over and over and over again uh oh look another one of those 3d glasses what the hell is this oh i keep forgetting the 3d glasses is meant to send you into vr mode which is okay but it's it, it's pretty much like a, it's just like a poster really a surrounding poster that just it could be, have a lot more added to it. It's not bad, but there's too much missing from this. I mean, I feel like if you really wanted to make this app really good, is to allow the person to walk around in VR with a controller to maybe go upstairs, go downstairs, you don't have to tap on things. Maybe you could interact with more items instead of just simply, wait, can you actually shoot this? No, it just sits there like that, whatever. But... There's so much stuff you can interact with, or at least you think you can. There's cigarettes, a lot of underwear around here. There's, uh... uh there's other stuff, but, uh... I try to avoid looking at it only because I do not want to get any copy strikes or... Or have people complaining, because... Um... Oh, okay, that was just... Oh, thank God. I, I thought something horrific was about to happen there. <laughs> Woo! Um, but I've already been in here before, and uh, the, this app, these apps can really- Oh, look! There's the original, uh, picture of his father. I wonder if he could tap up- No, I can't. I didn't see that one before. I think they made tiny adjustments and, uh, differences to some of these things. What is this? Uh, ignore your curiosity. Step inside if you dare, who knows what- Might be fine. Oh yeah, for some odd reason, there's one video- uh, leading to YouTube, but it doesn't relate to the gorillas at all. They, they've added some very, uh, strange things to this game. Well, not game, but more VR experience. Uh, you know what, maybe I will go into 2D's room. I don't know if you guys are seeing this. Hopefully you are. Maybe. Maybe not. I have no clue. I do not know if this is 2D's room at all. I'm just hoping. Maybe. Maybe not. I don't know. Well, there we are. Into... not 2D's room? What the? Oh, that is so nasty. Can I touch that? No. Oh, okay, never mind. Well, pretty much it's just how, I guess, they would treat their house to begin with. I mean, if you ever look in some of the, uh, another world of gorillas. Telecom, electronic beats. Take me there. No, I'm good. I do not need to go to anywhere with their beats. They're, uh, Apollo. Uh, welcome to the world's famous Apollo Theater. That's pretty interesting. I don't think I've been in this room before. I mean, I've been into all the other four rooms for the other band members, but I have not been in this room. This one doesn't look like a... Uh, well, what's it called? A, uh... Oh, I can't remember. It doesn't really look like one of their rooms. Bedrooms, technically. I know they always had different houses all the time, too. If you're ever going to look into their, uh... What's it called? The, uh... What the fuck is that? Oh, it's a gargoyle. Never mind. I guess I can't touch it. If you ever look at their other other um, uh, albums, their uh, each album always ended up having to move to a different house or some other place that would be interesting. Uh, just, but yeah, as you can see, I literally can't do much besides to tap on things that lead me to links that bring me out of the app, which is not a good thing because I do not want to leave the app. I want to stay in the app. And yeah, I know my face is still stuck. That's something I can't really fix right now because the app and this other app are both, I guess, not working well together since this is new. But hopefully they'll fix some things. Oh, Kong Studios, hell yeah. Oh, well, that, that doesn't do anything. But that's okay, though. But, um, this app's okay, but it could be so much better. So many things could be added, so many things could be taken away. A lot of things that are very useless. 
uh, I mean, you can't really interact with 2D or, no or Noodle or Murdoch or Russell, which is all four of them right there. Um, wait, is that the other? Oh, wow. They even have the mechanical 2D there. That's interesting. Uh, but if anybody's actually wondering who the mechanical... Oh, wait, is that 2D? Or is that the other Noodle, mechanical Noodle? Because I know that um, during one thing they had a, a mechanical noodle with them for some reason and she was uh she looked pretty much just like that except she wore clothing that resembled that of like a I guess a uh, a soldier or something kind mm, no I'm not gonna buy any tickets but thank you though it's, it's nice of you but I'm not looking to go anywhere I don't have the money for it <gasps> samurai sword but why is that out here though and I guess I can't tap on it either. If you ever, if you ever see me, you know, if you ever see the screen shake a little bit, that's because I'm tapping it. And it, this thing does work on both turning the cell phone and doing a, whatever, uh, you do on the screen. Gorillas on the telecom, electronic beats. No, I'm good. Yeah, it's just, no, no, go back. This app is quite disappointing to me, to be quite honest. I mean, I have listened to the Gorillas for a long time and I've really enjoyed all their, uh, their uh, stuff, but this could have been better. I mean, there, there's a. Uh, I mean, it does have some cool things. Don't get me wrong. I mean, we're in their home, their newer, newer home that they now live in, I suppose, until they decide to go and make another album, which ends up forcing them to go to another. Uh, uh, what's it called? Another building or something. What does this do? No, it just takes me to the music again. Okay. Well, I guess you could download it and check it out for yourself. It's, if, if this does interest you, just, you can always check it out and then rate it and whatever. But I hope you guys at least enjoyed this little review on this small app. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.